Now it's very rare I get to sit in front of you and tell you that the product I'm about to review is a potential game changer. Yeah, we get a lot of marketing hype thrown at us and uh, I relay that information to you and I know it can upset you at times because uh, in the last few years, they've uh, manufacturers that is, probably failed to deliver on their promises slightly. But I'm looking at a product right now that is what I would consider a potential game changer, potentially a massive help to average golfers. Putting is a real key area of the game and we've seen last year Callaway brought out their triple track golf ball. So essentially a visual aid to help you align your ball to the line you wanted to set your ball off when you were about to put. They've took that one step further and very cleverly took that one stage further in terms of their own sales because what I'm about to explain really means that if you like the idea of this putter, you're also going to need to buy their golf ball to make it work as it's intended. So a very clever move in terms of sales from, uh, from Callaway. But let's just take a look at this putter. And what you can see is they've done is just replicate what you see on the golf ball. Those three stripes, the three colours that have been chosen, the width of the, uh, of the stripe has all been designed based on scientific evidence of what suits our eye and all there to assist us in aligning our putting. But when you take a closer look, you will see that it's a very simple and straightforward um, it, when we think of all the science that's come out and we talk about AI and all the other stories that have come out in recent years, this is a very, very simplistic um, concept, but one that already gets your mind thinking, do you know what, that could work. And that's exactly what I thought. And then when you get the product in your hand and ball and start to align it, you then think, actually, do you know what, this could work. Then take it out on the golf course. And that's what I did. Took it out on Conway Golf Club, and let's see how it fares in the hands of an average golfer. Right, so before I get testing on the way out here on the course, let's get in the comments section going. I want to hear from you. What do you think? What's your first thoughts at this stage, even before any performance, before you see what I can do in terms of performance on the greens out here at Conway Golf Club? What are your thoughts from the story from Callaway? Because I must admit, I'm pretty impressed with what they've got to say here, and I'm very hopeful the will will translate into some performance and ultimately certainly it's not about holding puts it's about setting a ball out on the line that you you intend and after that it's whether or not you can read the greens properly but let's go and see let me start off with my first explanation of what i mean by an alignment aid is a good thing but at the end of the day stroke is still like we've said in many different uh, trials and reviews that we do ultimately it's down to the individual and whether or not that ball gets in the hole whether or not you hit a good drive or a good iron or whatever it's down to your swing capabilities but the thing that triple track has done it's give you a, a head start if you like it's give you a bit of a leg up in terms of i'm going to show you a putt now which has got a fair bit of break in it so first of all i've got the ability to read that break no matter what line or how i set this thing up if i can't read that break and judge pace at the same time it doesn't matter what I do with club and ball in terms of lining it up. But the important thing for me is it, you are able to set the ball off on the line that you intend. I'm going to have a little go at this putt. So I would start the putt off four or five inches to the right of the hole from my side, which is where this is now lined up to. And obviously, putter sitting behind it. This would be interesting. And perhaps a little bit too firm up the hill and not as much break as I first thought. But ultimately, I set the ball off on exactly the line that I aimed, so it done the right thing. But like I said, break, being able to read pace, is still going to be determined as to whether or not I hold a putt. When I move the camera and get to a different position and put this putter to the test, in what I think is the ultimate decision as to whether or not triple track works in terms of performance. Right, now this is where it gets serious. Flag is coming out because I'm a bit old school and I still can't put with that thing in. I don't mind it from a distance. Right, ultimate test for me. Like I said, we've just done the big breaker. But what I'm going to do, what have we got? Six, seven foot. Straight up the hill with a bit of power. I'm going to line it for straight down the middle of the cup. Putter gets lined up with ball in line with cup. Great in terms of being able to see if you're square or not. Straightforward enough stroke, 
bit of power on it and we want to rattle this one right in the back of the cup and for me this is where the triple track system is really where we can judge it at its strongest it's a straight put it doesn't get any easier than this the issue that i would have had in the past is alignment and alignment not so much as getting perhaps the the, the line of the, the 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 break if you like but being able to see whether my club head is square to the ball and i think that's the biggest thing by having those two lines connecting it's being able to get that ball that club head and ball square so in theory in theory eh? isn't that great all of the pressure's on now i've built this one up all i've got to do is execute straight up the hill with a bit of power can i do that hello Hello, triple track is going in the bag. Now, some of you may think that's a very, very simple test, but I think it's the ultimate test in terms of triple track because, like I said, any other thing that you try and do around here is all about break, is all about pace. When you talk about distance, it's about that little bit of luck being thrown in. But the big thing about triple track for me is being able to pick out a straightforward line and set your ball rolling off on it. And to me... When you're getting in those tricky ones and three or four footers and you know it's all about just hitting it firm and straight, but being able to have your club head square and in it firm and straight rather than just leaving a little bit open, pushing it down the right-hand side, pulling one down the left, just having that club head square to start with, right bang on line for that cup, I reckon could be a real confidence booster to a lot of putters. I love this idea of triple track, I've got to say, and it's not just because I've hold that uh, little six footer i think this is uh, seriously i think it's potentially gonna be the biggest selling putter certainly a 2020 could be in no, but that was right on the line that I aimed for. So that's a positive. The one thing I will just pick up on at this stage, the only slight concern I have with this, and it's, believe me, there are only positives that I've got to say in terms of performance, but in terms of speed of play, I have a slight issue. I'm a fairly quick player, and uh, I have a bit of a bee in my bonnet, if you've ever watched uh, any of my uh, videos in the past, where slow play is a thing for me, and... I'm finding that I have to take quite a lot of time to first of all, and it's a positive in terms of performance, like I said. So I'm, I'm spending a little bit of time in terms of getting the ball lined up or the lines lined up to the hole, the line I want to pick. And then I've got to address the ball and marry those two lines up. And it certainly takes a lot longer. So I think it's going to impact in terms of uh, pace of play potentially. If four of you are playing with a, uh, with, <laughs> with a triple track putter, I think it could be a long old round. But like I said, on the positive, on the flip side of that, it does cause you to concentrate on your putt as well. And I've got to say, like, I mean, I've already said on numerous occasions, the performance of this thing in terms of alignment alone, the face and everything else is, you know, we've we already seen that before. But the alignment aid is unbelievable. I think that's as much as I can do in terms of testing it. Uh, putter tests are always difficult to do, but I think we've proven that triple track definitely works what is it is what it is intended to do it does without any doubt it's one of the first tests that i've ever completed where for me you can categorically say that the science the technology the idea the concept behind triple track ball and club head alignment they definitely work and it's not often you can say that when you're doing a club review Anyway, as ever, thank you for watching. I'm going to get a bit of a beer and a warm and uh, back in the clubhouse at Conway Golf Club. Leave your comments down below and uh, I'll see you all very, very soon.